Hey guys, welcome to the President and Vice President web shop. My name is Olivia and I am the Division 13 Lieutenant Governor. I'm Carly and I am the Division 7 Lieutenant Governor. My name's Addie and I'm your District Governor. Let's get started. As President, you are the face of the club. It is your passion and enthusiasm that encourages other members to serve. You are also the pe person people are going to go to with questions and ideas. So remember to keep yourself available because you are the resource to both your board and your members. Don't forget the KFAM. You're responsible for fostering relationships with your local KFAM club. Wow, that's a lot. Let's divide your tasks so they are easier to understand, starting with your weekly duties. Plan club meetings with advisor, whether that is weekly, bi-weekly, or monthly. Create an agenda for your meetings and get it approved by your officers and advisor. Find and plan service opportunities to provide for your members so that they can serve their homes, schools, and community. Also, keep consistent contact with other officers, club members. Make sure to check in on how they are doing, both personally and with Key Club. If you notice someone isn't completing their duties, ask if they are okay and if there is anything you can do to help. Now we're going to look at your monthly duties. So you should assist your secretary in filling out the MRF due on the fifth of each month. These forms are incredibly important for our record keeping, so please fill it out accurately, even if you don't have service hours. The link to your MRF will also be provided in the description. Um, as well, at least one month, you should meet with your fellow officers to plan the upcoming month. This includes meetings, service opportunities, upcoming events, problem solving any issues, and catching up with key club related updates. Um, you should also respond to your lieutenant governor's monthly newsletter that is sent out on the first of each month, as well as any other emails when you receive them. Um, also, keep in contact with your KFAM clubs and ask if they would like a key club representative at their meeting. And lastly, your yearly duties. You should always strive to make your club bigger and stronger than it was the year before. Whenever problems arrive, stop and think how you and your officers can address them and keep constant focus on membership recruitment and retainment. Next, set goals for your club and provide opportunities for those goals to be reached. Submit your dues. Early bird dues need to be turned in by November 1st and normal dues are due December 1st. Attend your LTG's DCMs as often as possible in order to provide updates to your club. Cooperate with your LTG in setting up visits for them to your club. And attend our annual district leadership conference or DCON. This year DCON will be held February 5th through the 7th at the Hyatt Regency in Green Bay. Can't wait to see you there. Hold elections for new officers and remind the new board to submit their club officer information form so the lieutenant governors are contacting the right people. And lastly, provide materials slash training for your successor so they can start their job on the right foot. Now we will talk about the right hand of the president of your club as vice president. This means you will work very close with your president. As vice president, you have many important responsibilities. This includes being a resource to your president, fellow officers, and the members of your club. It is also important to remember that you are the person to step in during times of need or when the president is absent. To make this easier, we're gonna split your duties into what you roughly do on a weekly basis. So you're gonna monitor and assist your committees if, committees if you have them. You're gonna assist the president in running, in running the club and you're also gonna help the president find service projects for the members and support the president by communicating and assisting where you're needed. Now for your monthly duties. Assist the secretary in filling out the MRF, which is due on the fifth of each month. Meet with your fellow officers to plan the upcoming month. Respond to and read your Lieutenant Governor's monthly newsletter that is sent out on the first of the month. Attend all club board meetings, club meetings, and committee meetings if you have them. And make sure attendance is taken at every meeting. Moving on to your annual duties as Vice President. Contact the past vice president for information and insight on how to do your duties, create successor materials in order to create an easy transition, assist in the training of new officers, recruit new members in order to develop the club, attend DCM and district events whenever possible, and lastly, attend our annual district leadership conference. 
Again, DECON will be held the February 5th through the 7th this year at the Hydrant Regency in Green Bay. Can't wait to see you there. Hey guys, isn't there a way we recognize the president's and vice president's hard work? Yeah, every year at DECON, we give away distinguished president and vice president awards. That's right, and all you have to do to get one is do your job well and apply. The applications for these awards will be linked in the description if you wanna find out more. Thank you guys for listening. Contact us if you have any questions. We can't wait to get to know you all.